It's Two Minute Latte with Rabbi Batya. This week we read about the infamous rebellion of Korach and his gang that went up against Moshe. Korach accuses Moshe of nepotism, taking the leadership for himself and appointing his brother Aaron, the high priest. The ground opens up and swallows them alive. In the beginning part of the story, we hear about a member of the rebellion called On Ben Pellet. However, towards the end, we don't hear his name anymore. Where'd he disappear to? Our sages tell us that his wife saved him from the terrible punishment. She tells him, why would you join Karl's rebellion? His contention is that Moshe has taken the leadership and made everyone follow. It might sound like a worthy cause to sign your name up to, but think about it. What will happen next? Let's say Karl does overthrow Moshe. Will your status change? No, you'll just be a follower of Korach, no better off than you are now. When I married you, I didn't see a follower, I saw a leader. Now I need you to lead. Go and tell Korach that you don't want to have anything to do with this. And On did just that, and his leadership was recorded for all eternity in the Torah as the man who revolted against the revolution. When you're looking to get married, you're never going to find someone who has exactly all the qualities you are seeking. You are not perfect, and neither is anyone else. So you have three choices. Choice number one, keep dating and dumping and waiting to find Mr. or Mrs. Perfect. But here's the 411, they don't exist. Choice number two, find someone who's half decent and fix them up later. Here's another insight. People who do that get divorced. Choice number three, you're not looking for someone perfect, nor are you looking to change a person. What you should be looking for is someone who you believe will bring out the best in you and you will be able to bring out the best in them. On's wife recognized that this revolt was beneath her husband. He wasn't a follower, he was a leader. He didn't need to be part of this gathering. Stop looking for a perfect product. Stop looking for a product to fix. Start looking for an individual you admire and want to grow together with. May you find your bashert very soon. And for those of you who have a bashert, bring out the best in your partner. Shabbat Shalom.